on today's event because I'm the child welfare officer for my local hockey team and we needed a range of people to come and just be updated on child protection issues and if anyone wants to make disclosures. I've come today to learn really, which I've really say I have. Um, it's been significant. It's another opportunity handed to us by the states to keep us all updated with the safeguarding issues around children in Jersey. We've been educated on things that we didn't know about at all. We protect the group in the middle. Why do we protect the group in the middle? Because it's part of their identity. Well the transgender is something that um, was relatively new to me but actually identifying it in the class is not something I've really thought about um, and it's certainly something I'll have be open and more considerate about in the future. I've learned quite a lot about the LGBTQ community and how to deal with certain issues that arise in that. Um, it's made me more aware about transgender and what issues the transgender community face at the moment. E-bullying is um, is the modern way people are doing it so we have to change our ways as well and be mindful of not just the physical but the emotional and mental state. It is tricky getting around social media with the young ones at the moment. We've made a Facebook hockey page but with the issues of that with our development team and things like that we can't have certain people access the page as just to make sure we're being safe and we're being inclusive as well. What do I need to make sure that I know for my own personal safety and then what we have to say to the girls because um, we know you know they're using the Snapchat. I didn't realise how far it, it did go out there and how quickly it does get to people. Yeah. It's always good to hear what else is going on and comparing notes and it sort of domino effect is not just about safeguarding then it's about what else we do within sport in Jersey and how we can all help each other. It's been brilliant to get the information and to understand more about it. I, I thought it was excellent. I think it should be a yearly thing, not even just for community welfare officers, for local clubs. I think it should be an island-wide thing going into schools. I think it would be really beneficial for young people to understand about other things like LGBTQ um, and inform them. You learn something each time you uh, read see it and I think it's something that should be a regular part of um, any club um, and I look forward to attending again.